Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another stream of me and Miss Lucy. By the way, hey, here's Miss Lucy. I hope everybody's doing well. Welcome to stream, Maria and uh, Rennie. Hope both of you are doing well. Good morning. Oh man, I'm sorry you're sick. Uh, it is the season, unfortunately. Hopefully it's uh, not too bad. Let's go ahead and put our um, gaming screen on, by the way. We'll load into um, where we left off. Oh man, she's get she's getting her twelve month shots. And they they grow up so fast, don't they, Maria? Ooh, ugh, gotta wake up, chug some coffee. I should just take the whole coffee pot. Pour it straight down my gullet. Let's go ahead and give you a starry on. Do you have a uh, speak with dead that uh, necklace on? You can check uh, where the helmet is. You don't. But I think you have Speak With Dead, don't you? Did you get that amulet in the, um, I don't remember. Where we found Withers, the one that asked you all those questions. You know what I'm talking about? I don't know what it looks like. It's got like a skull. <clears throat> Check in a Starion. Maybe uh, you put it in a Starion. Hit L2. Oh, yep. He's got it equipped. See it? Up one. Speak okay. with dead. Yeah, so he's got it equipped. Uh, it's totally up to you if you want to equip it or if you want to keep it equipped on a Starion. But you can cast Speak with Dead and Speak with Dead People. What it has in it. No, don't go there. Oh, man. Yeah, I really hope that she doesn't catch that. That would not be good uh, for a baby her age. Well, it's not good for anybody. I just got over uh, being sick too. I was, it hit me hard. I think I had that RSV or whatever it is. What you doing there, love? Run. <laughs> Trying to run? Whenever anything's red, by the way, it's stealing. See how the outline is red? You're like, I don't give a shit. I'm a barbarian. I will beat them in the face. They talk about me, like, reading their books. Don't let me into your library. Uh. That might be worth a look. Uh, what? <laughs> Shadowheart seen something. She's like, yeah, that might be worth a look. A rune? 
Uh, I don't know. Oh, this right here. See, it's locked. She found that. That's pretty cool. Softer than a whisper. I'm not being associated with this. <laughs> I'm gonna turn off some candles. Don't mind me. I'm just so playing with fire. Progress. Careful, I'm by it. Let's keep to the shadows. You hit square if you're wanting to do that. And then down to lockpick. It's been a minute since since we played, so. What the fuck? I can't even see a lot to pick. What? Could he not pick it? Nope. Oh, okay. Oh. We're in the clear. Miss Lucy doesn't want to uh, rob people. <laughs> or the druids of their valuables. Oh, just to let you know, this dead person you can talk to if you want to. Oh my god, stop <laughs> <laughs> Yep, yep. Or, no, not examine. You have to hit R1, and then hit R1. Oh, nope, it's down there. See, level 3 spell, speak with dead. And th that'll uh, work until a long rest. You just have to hover over, speak with the dead. Er oh my god. <laughs> you have to hover over the dead person. I'm sorry. Words. Anyway. The corpse regards you lifelessly. Minthara, back at camp. All right, Maria, you have a great day. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you start feeling better soon, and I hope that uh, Scarlet doesn't catch what you got. I know that can be really scary, especially for you know, just a itty bitty, you know, baby. So. Be safe and feel better. Scouting. Found druids. Where did you get the temple? The corpse remains silent. It doesn't understand the question. Were you abducted by the Mind Flayers? No. Did you start following the absolute? Oh. Moonrise Towers. Initiation. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. I'm like, hey, don't steal stuff. I stole something. <laughs> and I so just want my bed. I'm gonna loot the drow too. Track the druid, find whatever bar or burrow he runs to, and report back to me. Remember, you are only a scout. 
Do not engage. Do not kill anyone. Simply observe and return. I shall de ah, ugh. I shall decide what we do next. M. Don't mind me, my shirt little guy. <laughs> Trying to sneak. <laughs> uh Yeah, we did. The only thing I didn't talk to is I think the wolf. But I don't know. That doesn't seem like a big deal to me unless you want me, me to talk to him. I don't know. <laughs> I've never talked to the wolf. I don't I don't normally play a character that does speak with animals. If I do, it's usually like I have a potion and it's something like I'm like, "Oh, this seems interesting." So it's totally up to you if you're like, "Oh, what you know, just yeah, kind of play by ear. Some okay. Where to next? Oh, <laughs> you're still loading in. <laughs> Why did my side load in faster than yours? That's weird. <laughs> okay. Few outsiders are allowed in here. Be respectful and do not interfere. Sure. Uh, he, he doesn't. He doesn't. Yes, I did. Uh, see down there. Speak with animals. But I mean, he's a druid. Even if he was a bear, I'm pretty sure he could still speak. Yeah. It's my job too. The druids don't care about us. No one does. We have to look after. You ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. Mom, I'm fine. Stop it. Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. That kid right there. Um, she's a cool character. I won't spoil anything for you, but really cool character. I like the character building they did for that little kid. Yeah, hopefully she doesn't steal again, because uh, I don't think they'll have much mercy on her then. Yeah. I mean, thank you for helping me. Stop. Yeah, Arabella, she gave you a. Fine. Your mother was a jewelry. half feet away from some bling bling. A bear. Isn't that how mom <laughs> usually is? Quiet, you. You can pop. check out what it does. What does that one do? Might be good for a Starion. You never know. Oh, you never equipped his gloves of power. Oh, wait. Hold on. No, that's... On a hit with a weapon. Oh, yeah. You never equip, equip that. That's sleight of hand. That gives you a plus one to your thieving stuff. Should probably equip that on a Starion. I was gonna look at that necklace. Oh, dancing lights. That's what. Stealing that would be good item. on Astarion. Really I, for, I guess it could be okay on um, Shadowheart, but me? I would think that it'd be better on Astarion. Hey, do you want to use this Mind Flayer tadpole, by the way, or are you good? You want to stick another tadpole in your head? Totally. Uh, I'm going to if you don't. I'm not kidding either. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to eat this tadpole and put it in my head if you don't want to. 
Um, no, I'm okay. I think I'm, I'll be all right. Thanks. Sure. The parasite is Ooh. stubborn. It refuses both to leave or to allow itself to be used as you desire. Oh shit, I can't put it in my head. Sorry. I'll try again later. <laughs> that was a please try again later <laughs> message. <laughs> uh, it's our job to get us out of here safely, not yours. It's my job too. The druids don't care about us. No one does. We have to look uh, after ourselves. Arabella. That's what Mole says. That girl. I don't care what Mole says. Yeah, you should equip those. That's that's just all around good for a Starion. And then the dancing lights. Yeah, I wouldn't use that on him. Oh, you'll be able to get a Starion a really good dagger coming up. If you find it, that is. Speaking of which, is that blood? No, never mind. I'm throwing everything on you. Oh, unless it's uh, Stop. like crafting stuff like I for alchemy. Your mother was a heartbeat away from fighting a bear. Isn't that how mom usually is? Quiet. You <laughs> Isn't that how mom usually is? I'll make our potions for us. Sound good? Send that to camp. Just once. Oh, I can throw some. Or, well, one caustic bulb. And then I still have two of these void bulbs. Don't forget to throw me whenever you get a chance. Or a goblin. You can throw a goblin, like a dead goblin, at a goblin. It's pretty awesome. Not gonna lie. No, I have dark vision, and so does Shadow Heart. Stealing. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hold on. Let me clear my throat real quick. Thinking? I was trying to help. You nearly died. Did you hear me? Shadow Heart, because I'm she's a half done. elf. Any elves, half elves. Um. I think. Dra not Draugr, um, Dwegar, I think they're called, which are dwarves. They can, they have night vision, Look. or not night vision. <laughs> yeah, they have night vision, dark vision. <laughs> they put these fucking special goggles on every time they go into like dark areas. They're like, <laughs> what am I talking about today? <laughs> uh, but um, yeah, there's quite a few creatures and well not creatures well yes creatures and um i don't know like races that have dark vision Bells, it's our job to i'm get one of them safely not so i don't need a torch but it's you can sell those too. torches the druids don't and uh what us. are you playing as a human no one does okay so you we do have not have dark ourselves. vision meaning that a torch says. is very that useful girl. for you i don't care what mole says and matter of fact, Stupid if I really reckless. wanted to, maybe she doesn't have it yet. Let's see. Let's go to her spell books. She does not have it because she's only level two. But eventually, Shadowheart gets a spell called Light, and I can cast Light on one of your weapons or yourself, and you'll just have Light around you. So, eventually you won't even need a torch. You'll just be like, hey, can you cast light on me? And I think it's a level 2 spell? Maybe. It's been a minute. I guess. I was fine. <laughs> mole? Yeah, you gotta talk to Mole. But she said find Donnie. To and ask about the dragon's lair or something. And again. Swing and swing and 
He stares right past you, as if you're invisible. Or boring. Are you all right, kid? I mean, you look kind of dazed. Mm-hmm. All right, uh, got anything on your mind, maybe? Mm. He's still staring right past you. You see nothing out of the ordinary. As you turn back, the child slips between the rocks. <laughs> Investigation. I think that's a wisdom check too. Intelligence or wisdom? Yeah, it's intelligence. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> You can hit square though for a bonus yeah my bardic inspiration try not to use it all up this time because <laughs> then we can't use it in battles no it doesn't matter well over a 10 babe you find the edges of a concealed entrance well i'm sure not gonna fit in there you think maybe... Oh, me? You want me to use it? Oh, put the short guy in there. I think you, I think you can use it. It says use. Thanks, by the way. Referring to me. Uh. Oh, he didn't have anything to say. Ah, I can't get down there. Too short. Remember, I have a longer fall. You don't look so tough. Malfoy of a hobgoblin all by herself. Okay. Mole said I should thank you properly for the harpies. So I wrote you a story. Aren't you the clever one? That's very kind of you. It's about you. I hope you like it. Thanks, kid. When do... I get to run the ring scan. Sylphie needs to practice. You'll be out there soon enough. I bet I'm gonna be like you someday. Killing all the scary monsters. <laughs> going to own that town. Are you looking for more? Well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. Mercon says you got him out of a tight spot with some harpies. Gotta say, I'm impressed. You saved Arabella from the druids. Don't know what those bastards would have done. Well, I mean, I'm happy to help. You guys are just kids. And we're happy to be helped. Now, what can I do for you? <laughs> Getting right to the point, huh, kid? The 
I mean, what are you guys doing down here anyway? Making yeah. sure we're ready to leave when the time comes. And plus, I thought maybe you need a little help with something? I do, as a matter of fact. Revenge. You saw what those bastards that run the place were doing to Arabella, scaring the precious might. I want to steal that big, shiny idol they're all chanting at. An idol? What do you do with something like that? The important thing is to get it away from them. That ritual's gonna get us all killed. And we can sell it once we get to the city. Thing like that's gotta be worth a small fortune. I don't know if I should get involved in this. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that lady is crazy. But I, I don't know. I'll, I'll see what I can do. Be careful. They look as brittle as old bark. But they're vicious. Anything else? You have anything to trade? Is that a die over there to you, right? No, that's dark vision elixir. <laughs> yeah, that actually makes you big. Like, you get bigger and everything. Oh, yeah, I need to, I need to be taller. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, it says drink to increase your size. Weapons deal an additional 1d4 damage. You gain advantage on strength checks and saves. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, and saves, replaces effects from other elixirs when drunk. So if you have another elixir on, it's going to replace it. Okay. But it's not that expensive. 63 gold? I mean, how much gold do you have anyways? You should have at I least a thousand. thousand. <laughs> yeah. So I mean, she also sells, ooh, thieves tools for 126. <laughs> that's, a lot, that's a lot, but don't we normally find those? Yeah, we normally those? find those pretty frequently, actually. And as long as you're using a Starion to pick locks, you should be alright. Shouldn't fail too many. I'll take that Grease Ball. Oh. That's... Never mind. That's just Camp Supply. Yeah. Why do you need a block? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> I have no clue. You could sell that skull, the bones, that yeah, cup. There's a couple of things. This cup, too. Yeah. Like, that's just... Where's this? Grease bottle? I'll take those if you want them. Oh, because yeah. they essentially... Um, I don't need any plates, do I? I don't no, I you don't need any. <laughs> You're fine. It's all stuff you could sell. There's two bones up there as well. To your right. Oh. But yeah, see, um, creates a flammable grease surface, creates uh, creatures walking on it. Never mind. <laughs> uh, creatures walking on it have halved uh, movement speed and can fall prone. Shovels, do you want to no. Else shovel? Um, I don't know. Can you keep one of those crossbows so I can um have a crossbow in my hand? Okay. I like to have two crossbows. <laughs> Mr. John Wayne, gotta dual wield some crossbows. <laughs> if it ain't pistols, then it's crossbows. Is there an orange light? 
Um, yeah. He's proficient in light armor. He's a rogue. So, light armor is the way to go. You can sell that jewelry too. But did you did you hit oh you didn't balance offer. You just gave all that to them. What? For free. Yeah, he gave all that to them for free. You have to hold square to balance offer. But you could sell that jewelry too, those books. That extra shovel. I mean, unless you want to collect the books, you know. Those are sellable items. Mm -hmm. What does that do? Yep. It's literally a rock that somebody squeezed and... <laughs> yeah, bottles you can just straight sell. Broken loot, obviously. <laughs> Man, you just picking up everything, weren't you? <laughs> well, that's not even funny, huh? Um, <clears throat> we found those on the ship, so it's up to you. There's only um, oh, those brain jars. That's right. You can send that to a uh, camp. You don't want to get rid of that. It's a jar with oh, I'll take that though. Yeah. Now you got to hold square. <laughs> See, and then the coins go over. Also, if you don't want those, oh, I was going to say, if you don't want those spells up there, you can sell those as well. Like what? Oh, potion? you should keep that greater healing potion. I'm talking about the spells down there. Go down one. No. <laughs> See, scroll of uh, mage armor up to you. I mean... You already, I think, have over plus 13 to your armor class. Uh, but if you want to use it, you can. Scroll of Blindness. That's useful. This is like a one-time use? Yeah, yeah it's, anybody can use it. It's a scroll. <laughs> That's actually a pretty cool one. They'll like drop to the floor and laugh. <coughs> and I think each time they have to make a saving roll, a wisdom saving roll. Okay. Anything else? You've been a friend to us. Come back anytime. Not long until we I'm going to steal now. that other crossbow from you. Sorry about the nest. You guys find anything good today? No. <laughs> Everyone's got junk. Worse than junk. Don't worry, kid. In Boulder's Gate, purses practically grow on trees. Oh, that's right. I can't we'll dual wield. Because <sighs> I have a light crossbow. I need uh, another hand crossbow. If you see another hand crossbow, let me know. <laughs> because... I want to dual wield some hand crossbows. It's pretty cool. Huh. You said you wanted a void ball with me? Yeah, you just hit square and then go down to my name and then it'll send it to me. And no, um, the poison up there, that green vial, you can give that to Starion because he can coat his, well, anybody can coat their stuff. You can coat your stuff, um, but it gives him a little extra damage because at first rogues aren't going to be the most damaging type until they get sneak attack and then, you know, stuff like that. Or they have sneak attack already. Um, am I thinking of the assassin? Yeah, I think so. I'll take those grease bottles, though. I think 
hate you. When do I get to run the ring scan? Sylphie needs to practice. You'll be out there soon enough. I bet that scam is going to kill in Baldur's Gate. Don't get too attached to that con, kids. I've got bigger plans for the city. Oh, okay. I can't get down. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Oh, your character can probably jump all the way up there. Got to press up on the D-pad. Yeah, you can reach all the way up there. What's over to your right? You can hold uh, R3, by the way, to see items. I'm just saying in general, if you hold R3, it shows where people are looking and then see how I can see that book on mine. Okay. What about to your left? Is there anything over there? Oh, that's the gate will dumb. never see us coming. about the nest <clears throat> no everyone's got junk worse than junk don't worry kid in boulders gate purses practically grow on trees be patient we'll <clears throat> Hurt. <laughs> yeah, you'll take 11 damage and go pro and you jump all the way down. Absolutely. We're going to own that town. No. Damn, having Featherfall would help. But no matter what, you're going to take at least two hit points yeah, of damage. Uh, I don't know. I can't. It, it's making me, like, my eyes hurt <laughs> looking at it like that. I don't know. Hold on. Let me look where you're at. <clears throat> Oh, you jumped over there? Okay. Oh, get hurt. Oh. And then where I'm at, there's a spot to jump Did over to. I there's a chest over there mm. that I see. You'll be out there soon enough. I bet that scam is going to kill him both. I think we're pretty much done Don't in this get area. To that con, kids. I've got at least plans for down this in this cave. What's what? I'm at the uh, exit. We'll come get you. I'll save you. Um. Yep. You're yeah. you're almost to me. Nope. Turn around. There you go. Oh no. Nope, other way. Go, nope. <laughs> Look at the tiny little man on top of the mountain here. Here, I'll even put my arms on my hips. Maybe. No, no. There we go. Yeah. <clears throat> Look at me. <laughs> is this Starion following you? I don't know. Uh, no. No, he is not. <laughs> what a Might want to go over to him. Oh, wow. <laughs> Your character jumped all the way across to follow him. Go the other way. There you go. And then just go up top. Still breathing, despite everything. 
The gates will never see us again. <clears throat> Maybe he didn't want to climb down by himself. <laughs> he felt lonely. Over there, there's a uh, chest you can get. Too far, huh? Think that would uh, need Misty Step or something. Be patient. That's a uh, sorcerer, or well, yeah, sure, sorcerer, wizard type of thing. <laughs> Why did it take me longer to load in? That's so weird. Yeah, I know. I know. The way he runs. Thanks. <laughs> You're supposed to be leading the way, not me. I just think like the year end. <laughs> I know. I can tell. Again. Swing and swing and parry. No. I'm only going to ask you one more time, boy. Hand over my locket. I don't have your ugly locket. I've never seen it before. Hand it over or I'll slap the teeth out of your head! I, I don't know, but I don't, I don't think you should be talking to a kid like that. It's not yours. You threatening me? Even if they were. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with my barbarian. Strike that child. Go on. Let's see what happens. You don't understand. The kid stole my locket. He. Oh, the hell's with this? These little devils get away with everything because of coddling bastards like you! You'll get yours someday. Oops. I hope I get to see it. Maybe you will, but personally, I doubt it. See you around. <laughs> Doesn't taste half bad. I'd die if I met heroic and reeking of this place. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you're expectations are always shifted you know try to help somebody out and then you know they, they turn out to be an asshole <laughs> <laughs> he just ran off again how over long you want to spend in here baby swing. exploring Harry. I'm cool no. And again, swing and swing and... Oh. Watch your back. Don't be grumpy, Roland. We'll get to the city soon. I am not grumpy. Scowl on your face to frighten a troll. <laughs> You're an idiot. If I tell Martha, <coughs> we're gonna see him? Just gonna have to find out. <laughs> Let's get on with it. <coughs> I've got food, water, my dagger. Yeah. That was really good, babe. Swing and swing and... Stop! This place is off limits. Leave. <laughs> uh. 
don't worry, I think I'm here to help. Let's see what's wrong with you. Damn, nice. Damn it, was inventory today? I'm sorry, nerves are shot after the attack. Do what you gotta do. Sorry if I don't show you around. Don't you need a hand? Why are you on the floor? I just fall back down. Legs are as steady as a foal's. Bloody potion! I'd wager your potion was paralyzing agent. What? No, the potion worked! I'm strong as a bugbear and fearless! The old lady warned me that this might happen. That it was a side effect. I don't think you're a beach. That doesn't sound right. No, she's been nothing but kind to me. Why would she... Sorry, I need a moment. I'm not... Not feeling the best. But I'm sure it'll pass. Because he's got, um, ble uh, yeah, bless on him. I'm gonna heal her for you. Yep. Maybe. Let me go over to her real quick. Again! Swing, swing, parry, and And again. Did you want me to talk to the rat, I'm guessing? What to bring? How close do I need to be to this winch? You gotta stand on the right. Apparently. The thing I'm trying to help. You're not really supposed to be here, but I'll turn a blind eye. Just don't touch anything, all right? True. Still alive, so that's progress. Yeah, <laughs> the evil things in the chest. Oh. Yeah, I can't. I guess I can keep her attention if you want to see what's in the chest. I'm ready. Any goblin comes near me now, and they'll regret it. I feel amazing. Look, you're not really supposed to be here, but I'll turn a blind eye. Just don't touch anything, all right? I don't know what that key's for. Well, it said that this is locked. Never buy the potion off that old bat again. Well, you kept hovering over it and then stopping. Again. I'll talk to her again. Look, between us, you're not supposed not to be me. here, but I'll turn a blind eye. Just don't touch anything, all right? No. You just go to the locked, yeah, open. Not for communal use, it seems. Best show some respect. <laughs> or some more cunning. I thought you were supposed to keep her busy. What happened? I don't know. I forgot. My bad. <laughs> hey, lady. Look, between us, you're not supposed to be here. But I'll turn a blind eye. 
Just don't touch anything, all right? There's a rock that can be moved, but I can't move it. I don't have the strength. I think you do. You're barbarian, maybe. I don't even know where she's at. Did you leave her behind? Yeah. <clears throat> Never a dull moment. Yeah. It's right here. I'm a. Excuse me. I'm gonna lady. get my party out of the way. Yeah, I don't know where you could put it. I know you can spin it and stuff. I think with the D-pad or whatever. Well, I mean, you would have to put it in the room itself. Uh, I don't know. It's not. I'm. What do you mean? <laughs> Is it in my? Oh, yeah. You want? You have to place it first, and then it's. You know. Yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't even worry about it to be honest. Maybe you can hit it. Let them come. Goblins, gnolls. Well, I'm looking at I'm ready. what it's resistant to. Piercing, radiant, necrotic, psychic, poison. Yeah. You gotta hit R1. Again. And then swing, use a weapon attack swing, against it. Yep, parry. just like that. And again. And then, yep, target swing the rock. And swing and... Nice. Oh. Do it again. Okay. Oh, you can. No, go back. Go back. Hit square. See, attack, oh. main hand. Watch out, rat. Ha! Then do it again. Right. Nice. Got you got food. through now. Water. Maybe. My uh, or not. <laughs> what did that even do then? Oh, there's there's another one. I was like, what did that even do? Why did we even hit that? Or break it? Can you move that then? Oh, out of reach. Again. I think we gotta be on the other side. Interesting. Oh, there absolutely is, but I mean, <laughs> that's for you to find, babe. You'll find it. Don't forget about your jump camp too, like, to get to places. <laughs> Seems like the best way. Uh, I'm not sure I can follow you up there. Maybe I can, but I know I gotta jump up this stuff. Never buying a potion. I do not like being a, a gnome, just because it's very hard to. Navigate. How delicious. Rotting cheese. Mm. Ooh. I'm sending that to Shadow Heart. Oh. 
Looks like that thing is gonna explode just like this. What? Oh, oh yeah, they will. Oh, that was very weird. What the hell? <laughs> the camera just did what it wanted to do. Something over there. Nice. Let me out, you bunch of softies. I'm on my way. Just short. My legs. <laughs> Can't travel as fast as yours. Glowing eyes are so rarely a good sign. Best tread carefully. Time for discretion. Could wake him up by chopping off a toe. That'd be funny. Yeah. Give him something to cry about. Don't wear his voice out. We still need answers. Go ahead. Miss <laughs> gonna skin us. No one knows about this damn weapon. Oh, it did. Yeah. It's She'll a good kill thing. Us dead if we <laughs> I'll give you that. We'll get but the druid talking. It did Grove's something. Grove's got to be full of magic. What are we That's doing? That's why I've been stabbing all the rats. Might be spies. Mm, only one way to find out. <laughs> Pretty stubborn oh. for a man wearing <laughs> leaves. Maybe we can set him on fire. We should set the whole grove on fire. Maybe we can join Pastor. Sure. No sign of the others yet. Mm. Do you think the fire? Did front... some bleeding hearts show up to save the druid? I'll cut you to pieces. Kill them. Oh, he's not very nice. <laughs> I don't think you're under attack. I don't think so either. Ooh. Cutting words. Um, no, I don't think I need that in this fight. is worth the cost very well um oh i was going to do some bardic inspiration on you i think we'll be all right though without it give us some battle music oh my god that guy just messed me up Also, I don't know if you remember or not, but whenever there's a character next to 
like your character next to an enemy um a starion because he's a rogue can get sneak attacks because it gives him advantage it has to be something that you know gives him advantage to get a sneak attack and you'll get extra damage from sneak attacks okay you're welcome <laughs> Still playing. You missed me. Um, vicious mock. <laughs> My vicious mockery killed him. That's awesome. The gods take you first. <laughs> Back to music. Let's finish this. Oh, she's in the mud, that's right. <laughs> mud again, there's mud all over here. Can I reach this? Ugh. No. I'm gonna put a chance over here. <laughs> back might want to move him up a little bit is he using a long bow or a short bow if you jump it'll get you through places a little easier especially like when you're in mud nice these guys aren't too hard though <laughs> Still missed me. Fool! Can't stop these tasty jams. cutting words do the target receives a d6 penalty to attack roll ability checks or damage dealt oh yeah no i didn't want to use that but it did save it well it successfully saved on that saving throw unfortunately nice on you. Might want to get a little closer. Nice. Yeah. It's better. For sure. <laughs> Critical miss. It is better. It was better. Sorry. We killed him. Um, let's see. I need to, if you want to come over here. Let's go hurt someone. You're welcome. And then... Oh, I keep forgetting I have this stuff. 
thunder wave and stuff. Okay, I only have one more bardic inspiration, unfortunately. So. You want me to heal this guy? Still alive? Well, he's got one HP. Wow. Is that a yay or nay? I guess it wouldn't hurt. I need more help. Or do you want to heal him? You can throw a potion at him if you want. Sure. I mean, I can use a spell or you can use a potion Let's either move. way. I believe you can hit square, right? Yeah, you can pickpocket pick pocket him too. <laughs> you have to throw, you, like throw a potion. So that means you gotta, yeah. And then I think if you hover over it and hit square, hit square. <laughs> uh okay yeah no never mind don't worry about that go over to your left like hit l1 sorry and then see where it's you can throw it's like a hand throwing a rock yeah, throw and then you click on that and then you can throw a potion at him there you go Oh, thank you, thank you. I thought I was going to die down here. <laughs> How did those goblins slip into the grove? Oh, it's my fault. Oh, I thought I'd given them the slip, but they followed me through the tunnel back there. I must tell the others what happened. I, I step careful. There are traps in these tunnels. And thank you again. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> he was zooming. If you find a um, a uh, hand crossbow, let me know, please. And send that to you. Well, yeah, the, the goblins, if they have like a hand crossbow on them, let me know. <clears throat> Got it. Got to get that hand cl crossbow. Oh my goodness, words. <clears throat> oh, I knew that. I think that's all they're going to have. I'm going to have to buy one, I think. Ooh, look at this. Um, yeah, uh, she's stuck in there. Then. What? The grease and stuff, right? Yeah. I won't catch on fire. Oh, I won't. Be wary. This place is trapped. You didn't want that chest? What are you going over there? I'm not lock picking it. It's got a trap in it. <laughs> not my expertise. Nor am I going to blow myself up. I'm just hoarding a couple of things. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. Also, like, the higher your dexterity is the better, like, you're gonna be better at lockpicking as well. So as he levels up and you level up his dex, because eventually you will be Should able to do be that. Um, yeah. see, it'll... Yeah, that's yeah. The proficiency of uh, sleight of hand will go up as well. Yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, for like a druid or sorcerer. I keep saying sorcerer, wizard. Isn't there one that died up here or something? Or no? Uh, I, I did it again. Oh, you did? Got that goblin bow and... Yeah. I'm gonna go to the store. Uh... Oh. Oh, this isn't good. Where did you go? Um, there was like a door over here to the... Like, right or left. I don't know. Like it, it was like right over here. Something I can try and open. Uh, I don't know. I it led back to the grove, but it it had like some poison or something on it. I'm not really that worried about it. But if you want to go over there again, okay. No, I don't want to be poisoned. Oh, you're all good. Why not? Like a lot of fun. <laughs> Looking ahead. No. <clears throat> Goblin tracks. Oh, you can practically smell the filth. Yeah, I'm gonna go back into the grove. You're free to explore. Um, I just need to go back in here and see if I can't find a. Uh, crossbow. Wish I had a bag what of is holding. Red. Oh, it must be them up top. There's actually two shops in this area. I don't know if we went down to the other one. Or not? Uh, I think I did. Okay. Refugees, well met. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Damn. Is there no hand crossbow? Ooh, what's this do? Wow, that would be good for you, Ring of Flinging. <laughs> the wearer gains a 1d4 bonus to throw uh, damage. <laughs> awesome. Gloves of Missile Snare. Mm, that would not be that good for me. Yeah. I don't really want to talk to you right now. I'm gonna buy some blue dye. You cool with that? I don't care. It's your money, not mine. Well, I stole it from you. Oh. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not my money. <laughs> okay. But if you, if you want to say it's my money, sure. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> uh. What's yours is mine, and what's mine, mine is mine, <laughs> you know? Um, oh, that's a pretty good, um, oh, <coughs> maybe for Shadow Heart. Sorry about that. Sylvanas, guide your. All right, where's my shirt at? <laughs> Trying to color it blue. Need anything else? Nice. Did you want some? Of dye? course. But please remember, no, you're not the only one in he need. He sells it. If you go over to his stock. No, I just said I don't. Oh, my bad. 
Listen, I'm just trying to ask you questions here, ma'am. Yeah. Thanks for fighting. Oh, his dialogue just got cut out. It's fine. Sylvanas, be with you. I'm not upset. I'm not mad. Okay. I'm just kidding. Need anything else? Oh, he sells a pretty decent dagger for 88 gold for Starion if you want to use that. See, his dialogue went out. It's so weird. Whoa. Oh, die remover. Nobody needs this one? Um, it? no. No, none of us use any of that. Um, what does this do? Safeguard. Eh, just a. Yeah. Just here. Um, like, I. Could, but I, I don't want to use a spear. Okay. No, I'm just making sure we find it in a bit. Absolutely. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, I don't see a hand crossbow, unfortunately. Damn. Well, that sucks. Shoes. Where am I, I miss my forge. You want this uh, hat? <laughs> no, I got a hat on. My cowboy hat, remember? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't laugh at my cowboy hat. Jeez, <laughs> God. <laughs> Said stop laughing. <laughs> stop funny. Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> With a stutter when you buy and sell stuff. No. I switched over characters to try and work that. I don't need any attention right now. Oh. I'll wait until you're done. Um, yeah, like you can see, uh, where does it say it? Yeah, proficiency with this weapon type unlocks, blah blah blah, but. If you're not proficient in it, it'll say you're not proficient in it, but that right there would be better for like, unless you're doing a trickster with him, which can use spells, that would be better for somebody that actually uses spells, because it says once per, per short rest, you regain a level one spell slot when you land a critical hit with a spell thief. So yeah, that would actually be better. Um, for Starion if you go down the arcane trickster path with the spell thief. Well, level. you can't, not until level 3. Yeah, I'm on level 3. No, you're not. We're not level 3 yet. Well, I leveled up and it asked if I wanted to be trickster or... Oh, are we level 3 already? No way. It never ends. Oh my god, we are. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good lord. Okay, yeah. So, what did you go with? Um, I don't remember. 
<laughs> well, you can. Way. You first got to get out of this. Sylvanas, be with you. So yeah, that bow is not going to. Um, and then hit L2. Go to Astarion. And then hit R2. Go to the helmet. And then hit L1. He's just a thief. Uh, yeah. That's not a bad. That's not a bad um, class. That's actually a really good class if you're wanting to be sneakier and uh, you know lockpick and stuff like that. Thieves are really good. Um, assassins are super good. Uh, and even um, arcane tricksters are pretty good too. So. Yeah. College of Lore is what I went down. Okay, I'm gonna go into this grave. Oh. Freshly turned soil shifts beneath your feet as you approach the grave. Whoa, that was really weird. Uh... I'm going to use my bard to uh, sing a song for him. Your heart lightens as you finish the song. <clears throat> That's it. Okay. Freshly turned soil shifts beneath your feet as you approach the grave. <laughs> Look around cautiously, then begin to dig. No, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Maybe because we're further away, that's why it's doing that. It's got to load in down there, because look how far away you are. Oh, no, you're over there. You're purple. Yeah, you're pretty far. I'm almost done with the Emerald Grove. I think it's called Emerald Grove, yeah. Just remember, you can always go to your map and see where you need to go next. Aridan's back with his tail between his legs. I'm glad for your help. But I'd hoped you were Halsin. Seems like a lot of people are looking for that druid. By all rights, he was a good man. I saw enough of him to agree. And I'm tired of good people dying. That's for sure. Like we're being watched. Mm. One crisis after another. Uh huh. You don't want to go up this path here. There's a path. <laughs> uh, the enemy is surprised. Oh, cool. Yeah, you're right next to me. But that's... You're on a Starion. 
Yes, you are. Look up top. You can see everybody's... Oh, it's down there, too. Yeah. Because the initi uh, initiative. Everybody rolls um, initiative. Whoever gets the highest dice roll um, gets to go first. Yeah, you're going to have to jump or, or move or something. short <laughs> oh you can't get uh, you can't get sneak attack you have to have advantage it's gonna skip his turn because he's surprised there, now you're right next to me. You can hover over me and hit square. I think it'll say throw. Yep. Oh, well, then... Hold on. Hold on. I'll move ten feet. And then you jump. There you go. Now you'll be able to throw me. <laughs> Alright, we'll move a little more. I'll go another 10 feet. That should be plenty close enough. You can move right next to me. Now throw me. <laughs> throw me, baby! <laughs> uh, ouchies. Did it hurt you too? Yes, it knocked me prone. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, good. I told you to throw me. <laughs> well, not for next time. Don't throw you at something extremely massive. <laughs> it's true. Um, oh, that's only got a 36% chance. Um, I'll just shoot the fucking thing because that's got the highest chance. There we go. Now it's on you. You could probably get up top there where that lady is and get a better advantage because the higher you are, the more advantage you're going to have on your shots. Like, look. Oh, now it's 60. Maybe you got to be a little higher. Yeah, there you go. 10%, but it's you know, better than nothing. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> that hurt my dude so bad. What's next? Oh, you could rage and then do that. That would uh that would have boosted your attack. Um, I mean, yeah, like but then your rage is going to go away. You like when the thing with barbarians is when they rage, they have to either hit something or get hit to keep their rage for the next turn. Okay. So whenever you want to rage, nice. my guy is hurting bad. Um, whenever you want to rage, make sure that you uh, are going to hit somebody. Yeah. What? They just... That was really good for Shadowheart. <laughs> that Morning Star. Okay. I was like, "Oh, Morning Star." <laughs> More goblins. What's next? Yeah, she can use it, and it's better than her. Unless it's good for you, like it. No. Uh, 
magnified at least to me. Okay. Whips and blades always sharp. Whips and blades. Look at that thing. Fucking massive, isn't it? <laughs> Makes her hand look tiny yeah. compared to that fucking morning star. Jesus. Yeah. Gotta have a one beat the arm. <laughs> uh, yep. <laughs> Put some gloves on her. Stopped me yet. Uh, do you mind if I take a short rest? Yeah, you're... Oh, I can keep going. going a little longer now. That's hurting. You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. Too bad. I earned it, fair and square. Nice. You got advantage on it. Why not? Uh, yeah, you got me. Hand the coin over. I'll be on my way. Oh, yeah. I don't know for that, though. <laughs> right. That bloody ironies. Devils just can't stand to lose. Here. Now go back to the pit that made you. Peer through the telescope. Blurry. Yeah, that was really blurry. Oh, that's why. Oh, maybe not. Oh. Focus the telescope on the distant object. Yeah. Damn it, I'd rather focus it and try and take it from the screen. It's not really smart. Oh, come on. Could have, oh, got, could have added a book. Yeah. It's fine. I mean, it's kind of easy to tell it's dragging. <laughs> Move the telescope to the left or right. Cool. Uh, yeah, I've seen it left. The telescope points to the left. Move it to the right. See where the telescope see points where straight ahead. Oh, that's <laughs> it's just showing the dragon. I wonder if I can move it to the right again. No. There you go. Try that. Not funny. <laughs> of course, <laughs> you're like, I'm gonna get the bonus. Oh, it actually makes it clear. Cool. You see a dragon circling like a bird of prey, hunting. Oh, I just want to make sure I move the right now to see what's over there. Sure. If they look left, left the telescope right. points to the right. The telescope points straight ahead. I think you're just yeah. getting the same results now. But something's going on down there. Yeah. More coffee. Yeah. Way, way over there. What's next? It's true. There is. Someone's it... yelling about goblins. You should go check it out. <laughs> Where do you see these goblins? Glad you were here for those goblins. Picked one off yesterday myself. Shot her through the throat. Well, that should have killed her, but... 
She kept gasping. Clawing at the arrow. Kill? Yeah, don't worry. It gets easier. That's what Zevlo said, too. I hope you're right. I want to help. I just didn't think it would feel like this. Never a good feeling, even when they are terrible. You would know, huh, you barbarian? <laughs> Meat smash. <laughs> didn't say Incredible Hulk. <laughs> Go smash. Alright, fair enough. Oh, are we going to now? Yeah. Oh, We're yeah. pretty much done with the Emerald Grove at this point. I think there's one more person to talk to, but you can look on your map to see where they're at. Um, yeah, we were supposed to go on this way, right? Find the Who? Feel like we're being Zevlor? Yeah. No. See it? The Save yeah. the refugees. Yeah. Am I going the wrong way? Yes. <laughs> yes. I'll just bring you to him. Here you go. Follow me. I'm getting so confused. I know. Well, also, like, it's your first playthrough. Like, you don't know the layout of this map. <coughs> Wait until we get to Boulder's Gate. You're really going to be confused. <laughs> stand in the middle. Oh. Circle around. It's massive. That's what she said. <laughs> Actually, that's what I don't know. <laughs> no helping it. We're exposed now. Ladies first. You're the one who helped at the gate. Glad to have another sword. <sighs> we might need it. You're helpful. <laughs> he is. Or I heard is. what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. If the druids are this far gone, then it's not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? <laughs> you saw what they were willing to do to a child just for trying. It's Corga's influence. Without her twisting things, I believe the druids might see sense. I'm not sure why they don't get rid of her then. A low thought. But I'd be lying if I said I hadn't considered it. But the druids would slaughter us. We'd have to get close to Korga, within striking distance. I can't manage that. But they've already let you pass once. Not really some murder for hire. I mean, once I find Elton, I mean change things back to normal right it doesn't sit well with me either but to get these people to safety there's nothing i won't do you'd be well rewarded for the risk but if that won't sway you there's nothing more to discuss Scouts yet? no sir but if there's a clear path past those goblins they'll find it yes of course can i just convince you that leave and I'll follow you maybe for a little while. Our time grows short. 
If Korga won't abandon her madness, then we'll have to try the road, goblins or no. Surely people can fight off a few goblins. They don't seem too difficult. These are civilians. Open battle would be a massacre. Is that something else for a minute? What is it? Why did Tolkien go into the adventure, or go with the adventure? Some artifact Aradin was hunting. I don't know any more than that, and I don't want to. This grove is poorer for losing Helsin, but I have my own people's concerns to look to. And what brought your peoples out of the wilds anyway? We are refugees from Elturel. We took shelter here after gnolls and goblins attacked us on the road. We were bound for Baldur's Gate, and it was too late to turn back. Elturel had no place for tieflings after the descent. I guess not. <laughs> She's a barbarian. She ain't got time for books. <laughs> She eats books for dinner. That's how she consumes her reading. Oh, I figured I'd just throw the book to somebody else. Read. <laughs> yeah. Read this. <laughs> I said, I wonder, what is the descendant here? What, what is that? I'm surprised you haven't heard of it. The High Overseer, our Grand Protector, signed a pact with devils. It dragged Elturel straight to hell. Lucky for us, a group of adventurers found a way to bring the city back. Afterwards, people looked at us and just saw Devilkin. No different from the druids here, really. Ouchies. Yeah, crazy, huh? Well, well, we'll be back soon here, guys. We'll just figure something out for y'all. Commander! Just Zevlor, Tilly. We're civilians now, remember? With respect. Being a Hellrider is different. They only can and did. Yeah. What's up, my dude? Yeah, Running? <laughs> yeah. It's pretty silly. Don't think you're skipping. I am skipping. I'm so happy to play this game right next to you. <laughs> so my guy's skipping along. too high. Oh, oh. <laughs> you might be able to get up there. I, I was going up there. Um, I was afraid to get into the bubble. Okay. <laughs> I made it up there. Barely. But I did. You can do it. Oh, no. Our next run, I'm definitely playing a rogue. <laughs> or a fighter. <laughs> I ain't doing this gnome <laughs> thing again. <laughs> Yeah, well, it's very obnoxious not to be able to climb up anything. <laughs> oh, who got it first? Um, you did. <laughs> <laughs> I went to go steal it from you. <laughs> Aha. 
Nope. You can hold down R3 to see stuff. Don't forget about that. There's nothing else over here. I picked up a, the alchemy stuff. I stole it from you. That's right. <laughs> my, my, what manner of place is this? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation? Hard to say. For your journey is just beginning. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> They do know how to write them in Cormir, don't they? Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Uh, it's a pleasure. Hello. Charmed, I'm sure, in more ways than one. We should have a chat, you and I, but not here. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my tastes. Come. <laughs> You'll see. Whoa. There. Middle of somewhere. Uh, yeah, nice, nice decor here. Okay. The house of hope, where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. What makes you say that? Um, but are, are these theatrics leading somewhere here? <laughs> are you not entertained? Well, far be it from me to disappoint. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary? Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. Come now. Why play hard to get? When you're in deep over your tadpole head. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know if this is... Is Raphael really the, the devil? But he's just a demon. I demon. I don't know, but I think... In D&D, &D, there is like one technical devil, but there are multiple devils. devils. I was gonna say, but yeah. Because there's nine layers of hell. Avernus is the first layer of them. Jeez. You know, it's not smart making a deal with a devil. I, I 
And what is madness but a denial of reality? Still, I have a feeling you'll change your mind before it's changed for you. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. <laughs> I love Raphael. I'll spit out your tongue. <laughs> Jeez, that's pretty brittle. Well, if I do want to make this deal, how can I find you? I'll be around. Watching you squirm like a tadpole through a nice, juicy brain. All those pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say, you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. Just talking about alchemy. All right then. Why is your okay? I was like, why does yours look so messed up? Yeah, I'm all just gonna adjust. Right. No, I'm all right. Thank you, though. That might be worth a look. Ooh, what's this do? Guidance. Yeah, I'll put that on. Necklace has a Harper sigil. Why were they here? At the back of the crevice lies a bag enfolded in the chickenous swaddling of spiders. A shiny gold coin pokes from its mouth. Yeah. Oof. Hope for the best. Oh, thank nice. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> the creatures clutch the pouch possessively. You have no doubt. A spider egg is nestled within. I've got like goosebumps. <laughs> Either way. Either way, yeah. But I'm going to start my hand in there. That's a tough, uh, roll. <laughs> well, yeah. Wow. Nice. That, man, you're on it today with those rolls. <laughs> the spiders scatter, and you stash the bag. Yeah. Something clinks among the coins. Did what go? What are you looking for? Uh, the spider egg? It's just some clinging around. What a loot down. Oh, it's the bag. You see up there the bag with two things in it? No. To your right. See how it's got a little dot on it? That means it's new. Okay. Yeah. My blind eye. Yeah, it happens. I'll take it. Yeah, <laughs> I really, really do. Okay. 
All right. <laughs> I will. I know. Um, I'm getting a little hungry, babe. I think we should end for a little bit and come back. You want to fast travel over to me? I'm over at the Emerald uh, Grove. You just go to your map. Yeah, and then you go up. Yep. Also, you can hit triangle too. It'll give you a list of places to fast travel as well. So, let's go ahead and put our stream ending screen on real quick. Alright, we will be back um, eventually. I don't want to say soon, but uh, eventually. Uh, maybe later today. But before we end, I want to start by telling everybody thank you for stopping by and chilling with us while we play some Baldur's Gate 3. Really appreciate it. Uh, if you want to go ahead and say bye to everybody, Miss Lucy. Bye! <laughs> Alright everybody, with that all being said, I want to start by telling you all have a good morning, a good afternoon, or good night, whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.